Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Arcanum. We are in a, uh, an old temple of some sort, I think, with a uh, dragon blood pool thing. Well, looks like Chuka got stunned. Nothing to loot on that corpse. Nothing around here. All right. I don't know why they they don't pick up their swords and stuff afterwards. Actually, I suppose I could double check to see if maybe someone else picked up Magnus's sword. You have apparently dropped your sword somewhere too. Oh man. Guys, you guys are... You're, you're really pissing me off here. I mean, I know part of it's my fault for not... ...noticing when they're... ...dropping their weapons, but... The game is really, really dark. <laughs> no, not Sog. Where's the Dragoran? Get a frigid on there. Lots of Dragorans. They're very slow. This thing is very big. Good, nice dodge. I think that uh, axe of his might be cursed. Scimitar. There you go. Is there anything else around here? No, blood. Okay. Uh, I retrieved some blood, I guess. Vial of Dragon's Blood. Yep, yeah, alright. Let's look around a little bit more just to make sure that I'm not missing something. Nothing to loot. Okay. Setting off some traps. It's fine. All right, anything over here? Not seeing any uh, dropped weapons. What 
button here. I mean, if they're on the ground, then someone should go and pick them up. Okay, I don't see anyone moving. Nope, no one's going to pick any anything up. Let's run down here, just see if, uh... Maybe this is where they were, where the sword was. Did you pick something up? No. Hmm. Well, that is really frustrating. That I that is... I one of the more annoying elements of the game, actually. That people will drop weapons and not then automatically pick them up. Either at the end of combat or right away. Alright, well... Uh, given all of the stuff that we have, I think that I'm going to go back to uh, Tarant. And identify and sell some stuff. And we'll go back to the ancient temple, see if we can find what we dropped. All right, we've got a lot of gems that I can sell, so I'll uh, I'll do that. There we go. I was wondering where you were. Surprised your shop is open, sir. Probably could have uh, looted stuff, but oh well. Do, do, do. Take all of those. What? You're using the quality axe now? Sometimes I hate you, Virgil. Sometimes I hate you. <laughs> okay. Uh, let's see. You have no interest in that. You will take uh, this for 106. 71. 142. 71. 71. Might find someone to pay you 177. You have 33. Okay. Um, I've exhausted his money supply. I think that's what that means. So we're going to have to go uh, sell some, I mean, uh, leave some of these things here. I'm going to leave that. Essence of intellect could be good. Leave that. I'll keep the skin thickening. Pro I should probably use the haste. Leave the ruby necklace. Ruby ring. Any other gems that, uh... No, alright. I think I'll go identify the stuff first.
Some of them I know what they are already, though. Hello? Uh, can you identify something for me? Acts of lost time. Very slow speed. Chance to hasten on enemies. Yeah. <laughs> Charmed Traveler's Cloak. What else? Need to get that armor uh, identified as well. Uh, chill shield. D R E R F R M R P R plus twenty percent. Uh, strength, dexterity, willpower minus three. Okay, yeah, that's that's pretty bad. That is pretty bad. Uh, shadowing robes. Charm traveler's cloak. Shadowing robes. All right. Why did you just equip that? Need four high, all right. Uh, four by four. Kind of wish there was an option to like, not just uh, you know, get them all lined up this way and all lined up this way, but a line up in an L shape. Because you always have... I don't know why I'm moving these. Always have this problem with large pieces of armor. None of those are magical. Alright. Uh, Dread Armor. It has a massive amount of, uh, protection. Fire resistance, fire resistance plus 5, damage resistance plus 5, AC of 19 plus 31. Only weighs, uh, um, 100 stone. NP. Forget what NP stands for. Let me go uh, take a look at the uh, the manual. See if I can figure that out. All right, let's see. Just going through, okay, um, NP, noise penalty, well, I don't know that I care about that, um, so is this going to be, it's pretty light, Total AC 66, 37. Um, fire resistance goes down. Damage resistance goes down. Poison resistance and electrical resistance go down. 
but that's still probably better. Right? I mean... I guess I'll keep this around. Let's see, what do you have? An arcane axe? Um, another axe of strength? Magic robes? I'm gonna want more of these. You will not buy that. You will not buy that. Uh, I don't think you'll buy anything else. Okay. Well, that's okay for now. Wait, why do I... Is that seriously what Dread Armor is going to look like? That's like... I'm basically running around like I'm naked. Alright, well... Hmm... That's kind of disturbing, actually. <laughs> I guess it's the... Because it's the, the barbarian clothes uh, armor appearance. Uh, actually, I need to uh, repair this, don't I? Everything else seems okay for now. There we go. Get that fully repaired. Okay, let's see. Will you uh, buy this? 357, sure. 626. You can buy these. You can buy that. 44 coins for the Minara coins. You would buy the uh, Dragon's Blood. I don't think I'll sell that, though. Alright. Uh, let's take that back. Take that. else. Alright. Do, 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 do. 89 coins, 33 coins, 303, 117. Shoot. That was just the one that I didn't want to sell. Well. That's that's annoying. Alright, when was the last time I saved? I do not want to... Is that really before I... I did... Yeah. Oh, God. Uh, I'm sorry, everyone. I do not want to sell that thing, though. That's... Hmm. That would be just way too much money, so... And that. Go ahead and use this. I'm at moderate encumbrance. Can I give you this? Yes, I can. Good. Alright, I'm sorry, everyone. Dumb mistakes were made. Let's just get into combat with you. Take care of you. There we go. And you are... Okay, you are still using the Sword of Air. Alright, well, there's one uh, thing fixed. 
I'll save more often now. I don't know where he dropped it, but it was somewhere in here. Weapon dropped. Okay. So that's what that was. Stop it. Fine, I'll hold on to this for you. Alright, yeah, you you can use that. That's fine. I think. Minimum strength 18. Oh, whatever. I don't care. I'll just make another one for, uh, for Virgil. I mean, not Virgil. Uh, Magnus. Must have been a trap set up there. Maybe it was a disarm, like the uh, the disarm spell trap. I don't know. But we have fixed it, and I think the reason why no one picked it up is because that sword is so freaking long. It's the only thing I can think of. Not coming down to get me, huh? These guys take so much damage from this spell. I I can't really see the enemy. All right, you guys just take care of it. All right? Yeah, there we go. <laughs> just let them do it. All right. Now, did anyone drop a weapon? This is, this is crucial. We need to know whether anyone dropped a weapon. <laughs> yeah, just go ahead and kill it. It's fine. Okay, we got the, uh, the dragon blood. Okay, so we can expect that there's going to be a trap up here. Nope, everyone's good. Alright. Sog, you still have it? You do? Alright. Alright, maybe rather than going back to Tarant, I'll go see what we can do with this uh, um, Dragon's Blood, and then I'll go to Tarant and sell stuff off screen. Since you guys have already seen what what those items are. Come on, guys. Stop lagging my game. Still have it? Good. I'm, like, paranoid now that they're gonna drop all their weapons. Alrighty. Back to the ancient temple. Anyone going to pop out and say hi to us along the way? Apparently not. I'm okay with that. Are we going to get zombies attacking us again? Probably not. Seems like a no. 
That sounds good. All right, let's look for some junk piles along the way. Also swords. Uh, let's see. Virgil has space. Virgil has plenty of space. Go ahead and set everyone up so that uh, there's space for picking up a... Uh, a sword if they come across it. Nope, no one gonna pick anything up. All right. I may just scour the uh, this thing before I finish up the and head back to uh, town. Something just happened to someone. Well, oh. you have returned with the blood. Please pour the blood on me. There is an unbelievable longing in the skeleton's voice, a desperation. What will happen? What exactly is going on here? Alrighty. Oh, apparently I have lo dropped my uh, sword now. So now I gotta go find that. Ugh. Well, alright, before I use the blood, did anyone pick up my, my sword? Anyone pick up my sword? Yes, you did. Thank you. Okay, so, uh, what do I do? Is this use on you? Okay, human noble, level 20. Ah, yes, my flesh is restored. <laughs> uh oh. I'd forgotten the pleasures. The feelings, the rush of blood running through my veins. It's ecstasy. I have screwed up here, haven't I? Uh, who are you? Me? I am Torian Kell, warlord in the Grey Legions of the Darien Ka. How many years has it been? All of this and you, so unfamiliar. I don't know. How long were you like that? I... I don't know. I was a warrior, raised from the grave to serve in the undead legions of the Darien Ka. We fought a great battle with the... What was it? So many years ago, and I am all that is left. Alone. So alone. Torian Kell, I have so ma I have many questions. Might you answer them? Forgive me. I owe you a debt of gratitude. What question did you have? Actually, I have quite a few. Do you have a few moments? I mean, I would hope so, considering I just restored you to life. Of course. Uh, what is this, this place? This was the greatest temple of the Darien Ka. When the battle between the Great Legions and the Malokian Hand was over, we returned here, hoping to find our masters. They never returned. So, you were part of the, the Great Legion fighting the Malokian Hand, okay. Uh, wait, I have a few questions about the Darien Ka. What would you like to know about the Darien Ka? Who were they? The Darien Ka was the ancient order of the dead, formed by the disciples of the great necromancer Kurgan in the years following his banishment. They were a secret society, unknown for years, who practiced the arts of dark necromancy. Why was it so secret? What were they doing? Perhaps things are different now. But the practice of the dark necromantic arts was forbidden for many years. The Darien Ka lived among the shadows for centuries, wielding their dark magics behind locked doors, uncovering the secrets of the spirit worlds, soul poisons, the raising of the undead, speaking with spirits beyond the grave. So what happened to them? There was a great schism in the Order. 
Within the Darien car were an order of assassins. Mm. They were called the Malokian Hand, and for centuries they were the silent weapon of the Darien car, a deadly defense against the world and its prejudices. But one day, the Hand turned against the order, and there was war between them. And so, what caused the schism? I never knew what happened to cause that rift, but because of it, the Grey Legions were raised. What were the Grey Legions? The Grey Legions were a great army of the undead, raised by the Darien Kar as protection against the Malokian Hand. Our sole purpose was to eradicate all traces of the Hand, so that the Order could continue. Well, I'm guessing that uh, that didn't go quite as well as uh, hoped. Uh, you spoke of a great battle. Ten thousand strong we were, fearless and of one mind. Standing upon that battlefield, the darkened sky reflected in our black, burnished dread armor. The stamping cavalry on their shadow stallions behind the endless rows of the stone-faced pikemen. It was cold, but we had no breath. The air was so still. And the hand? The hand. Yes. The hand. The hand were the greatest warriors of their time. Quick, deadly, precise. They stood across from us, on the opposite ridge. Lightly armored, faces masked. Their archers armed, with elven great bows almost as tall as they were. And fire, stranger. So much fire. Well, go ahead and tell me about the battle. Oh, yes. There was a battle the likes of which Arcanum had never seen, perhaps will never see again. The hand threw themselves against us, we without death, time and time again. They severed the arm that held the sword, burned the body which held the arm, destroyed the souls within those bodies. The hand, you see, were themselves not unlearned in the ways of magic. So, um... Are these the guys, the source of the Dread Armor? Is that what you're telling me, sir? You, the the Grey Legion? Or were you still you, or were you using Dread Armor that was discovered earlier? Yes. The Grey Legions fell on that day. But so did many of the Malokian Hand. A few soldiers from both armies stumbled off the battlefield and were lost to history. The Darien Ka were never heard from again. You said you were the last. What did you mean? As I said, there were a few Grey Legionnaires who survived. Because we were undead, we walked Arcanum for centuries, trying to stay hidden from the eyes of man. But the flesh, even the flesh of the undead, cannot last forever. Little by little, year by year, our earthly shells decayed. Hence why you were a skeleton a few moments ago. Yes, and I was fortunate. Do you see the piles of dust scattered here and there? Those are the last remains of my companions, dead, but not dead. You see, their souls are still trapped here on this plane, forever tied to their earthly remains. A curse. A cruel, cruel curse. Is there nothing to be done? There is nothing I can do. The dragon's blood pool can restore the flesh, but even it has its limits. Nothing will ever raise my comrades from the dust. They will live on, without voice, without dreams, without vision. What will you do now, Torian? Now? I don't know. I don't belong here. It seems nothing like the world that I remember. All I know is war and death. Even after all of these centuries, I still feel the bloodlust, the need for battle. But mostly... I wish to free my remaining companions, as I have been freed. Perhaps I will try to find the means to do so. Hmm. Perhaps you should come with me. Come with you? But why? We are of different worlds, stranger. I am a deathless warrior, raised to shed blood in defense of a long-dead order. All I have left are my memories, and my hopeless quest. I seek something too. Perhaps you might find we might find answers together. Plus, the Malachian hand is trying to kill me. Perhaps you are right. So, will you join me? I will not follow one who travels the path of righteousness. <laughs> I figured as much. Was there anything else? I can ask you some other questions. Of course. Uh, do do do. 
What would you like to know about the Darien car? Of course. All right. Good day to you. Okay. Uh, I'm I'm not sure if this uh, has moved me towards good or evil or what, but um, like I I actually look at this and and I see that this symbol here pointing down. I mean. Okay, no, all right, my mistake. Um, yeah, the pointing up is is the the uh, the dark necromancy, and the down is uh, good necromancy. I, I, I get, uh, for some reason in my head, I had that reversed. So yes, I am I am going towards the uh, the good path. Anyway, um, so uh, yeah, apparently this is a uh, potential companion that we could have. Uh, but I'm I'm not evil. All right, well, um. That's about it for this episode. When we come back next time, I will see if I can find the uh, the sword that's around here. And hopefully I can. Otherwise, I'll just make Magnus a new one. Anyway, uh, that will be uh, when I come back. I'll also go back to Toronto and sell stuff and trade stuff. And maybe even look for more um, more of those uh, light helms that, that I have. So, anyway, that will be... Uh, that will be later. See you then, everyone.